welcome back to another monthly review. This officially marks three years of owning my Camaro. I specifically wanted to film this at night because I wanted it to have a kind of an intimate feel. This is one of my favorite views of the car underneath parking lights, uh, gas station lights, you name it. It just has all the car. The car currently has 61,500 kilometers, which is about 36,500 miles desperate need of an oil change but she is running like an absolute top went to a lot more car shows this year than i did last year hosted a lot less car shows than i did last year mainly due to just timing and scheduling wrapped up the acs composites aero kit with their uh deck lid spoiler with wicker bills i've got to say it, it really finished the car it really added the final piece of the puzzle i talked to them for almost one entire year about sponsorship before I actually got my hands on my MBRP and this has given this car an entirely new characteristic and personality. I've been spending a lot less time in front of the camera and making a lot less videos because the Camaro has become a bit of a, an overdone item at this, this age in its ownership. Even though the car is no longer new and the topics on it aren't that uh, exciting anymore, the car is still every bit as exciting as the day I bought it. I've been asking myself a lot, what's next? Uh, drag radials for sure. I would love to work with Texas Speed, put some power underneath the hood. And I think visually she's pretty much over the top and I, I've done enough that I don't need to keep adding to it. However, that does not mean that we are running out of projects. The trailer is in full swing. We are I have at least a dozen major projects left on that trailer to make it really, really epic. The car just has so much potential and so many memories left to make that I don't want to spoil it and I don't want to lose my turnkey enjoyment. So I am still working on learning how to drive it. I would love to road course it, maybe chew through a few extra sets of tires, um, try out some new brakes and just keep the monthly updates going on both the channel, myself, and the car on how it's running and performing and any issues that I may or may not have. This has now become the second longest vehicle I've ever owned and this has the most mileage I have ever packed into a vehicle. I did have a bit of the Cavalier moment with my previous Envoy that I put about 40,000 kilometers on in five years and I was so bored of it that I would do anything to get rid of it. And this car absolutely not it's amazing and i just have so many trips i want to take might be a bit of a, a wild card idea for next year but i would really love to take this car with the trailer on the pacific coast highway i've never even been to the west coast but i think that would be a just an amazing trip and an amazing time and having the trailer and being able to take a lot of stuff and a lot more comfort than otherwise available I think that would be a, a pretty good trip and I know that there's a few of the fellows that would love to go with me. Uh, that being said, the group this year has been unbelievable. Uh, Shady SS, Awesome ZL1 and Sinister 6.2 got me the barbecue for the trailer. I mean, the, the group knows that I'm really trying and the struggle is real and the grind is real and they are not just supportive but they're actually financially supporting and coming out to the shows with their time and and sharing the videos like it is incredible to see what community means when it's actually in effect i hope everybody enjoyed the intro i put to this video it was a bit different i really wanted a gritty real almost romantic feel to it because that is kind of how I feel towards this car and I have spent three years trying to capture and share my vision and what I see when I see my car and it's been a long process of learning how to film and edit and share to get myself to the point where I feel like it's actually what I want you guys to see. This is it. This is going to be the ultimate namesake. I have started doing the stripe work. Most of the roof is done as well, and they will wrap all the way. There will be side stripes. There will be a top hat logo. I've been experimenting with tires. I get a lot of mixed reviews on the little tires, but they do tow the best. Uh, they're a bit softer and a lower weight rating, so it doesn't bounce as much. It's not so stiff and rigid all the time. And then there's a few fun things on the inside. I've been working on trying to make it look a lot prettier, so I did remove the bar and I did install this box underneath. The door's kind of fallen off, so I gotta repopper with that on, but that will be for cleaners and 
cloths and all that kind of stuff so they have a nice little home. I move the hooks. I actually really like the hooks. They kind of grow me because they hang my helmet when I'm racing on those hooks. Um, but I didn't want them up here because I would like to mount a television or a 24-inch LED on a swinging arm for showing videos at car shows. You guys are pretty familiar with the inside. But I did panel the front, so I did finish. I had a lot of little gaps up around the, the corners of the cabinets. They are now all done and finished. I capped all the corners. The lights are in. Wiring has been put in as well. It is all fished and it will work once I get a battery. I am quite confident in that. Um, so I've just been trying to finish up the, the cosmetics inside. So when it's seen at shows or people look inside, it's not like, oh, it's cool, but you know, it's just another work in progress. No, it's actually, uh, it's coming along quite, quite well. Um, I got a lot of like the Bridgestone stickers off, but now you can see there's all just some nastiness. I might tape it off and paint it. I'm not too sure. Um, I just got a lot of work to do. I've been hanging... Uh, car show magnets on the side of the box here so people will see what shows I go to which is always fun the barbecue obviously and there with all its decals OCD which is currently underneath uh, the ramp so yeah that's it trailers coming along quite quite well One major project that I want to get done is put a roof deck on it, run a bit of an exoskeleton uh, corner post up and put a bit of a deck on the roof so that when we're at the racetrack I can get my own kind of private filming area and when we're at car shows I can kind of hang out up top and get some cool shots that may not otherwise be available. I'm not very tall, I have limited mobility, so if I can give myself a bit of an advantage, I'm going to take it and I'm going to run with it as, as much as I absolutely can. To summarize this up, this is my 2016 Camaro SS. It has all the stickers, all the stickers. When they asked if I wanted stickers, I just said yes. And this is where we ended up. 61,000 kilometers. Every one of them was thoroughly enjoyed and came with a smile. My name is Bob. This has been one heck of an adventure. And I'm very excited for the next stages of what we get to experience together.